See you now when everything keeps going wrong. Phone calls, interruptions, everything, wiring, confusion. Blah, blah, blah. Right, this fell off, but that would go on. Oh, just a connect. I'm just going to solder them together because, I, frankly, I've had this long enough. It's starting to go rusty, which is probably not the best thing to cook your food in, but there we go. Right, someone asked. Uh, now I've got a brain fart. Just for the third time lucky, my brain fart. Great. <gasps> right, someone asked where the wires go for halogen of an element. And I couldn't remember because it was many years ago I made this video and it went, oh, just it was just complicated and confusing and frankly it didn't go well. Didn't go much better this time either, apparently, third time. Um, so I thought I'd just make a video in case my instructions that I wrote down don't make much sense to anybody other than me. And even then I'm looking at it like, what the hell am I on about? Right, so one wire of the, 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 the element, which is just under here, which is under here, which you can't see on camera because of course cameras don't. Mm -hmm. One comes out, goes into again one of these blocks to connect all the wires together. One goes straight down to one side of the motor winding, nice. One goes down to the heat light, so it just shows you when the element's on. The other one goes to the power light. It's maybe backwards, I can't remember, but they're both connected to it anyway, it doesn't matter. Perfect. And yeah, the other one goes straight to neutral from the mains. The second wire again connects to one of these blocks. One goes to the heat light or the power light. I don't know. I've moved them and now I don't know where which one goes. I'm pretty sure, no, this is definitely the heat, the power light. This is the power light, that's the heat light. I don't know. I pulled it out and now I've got no idea where they go. But it doesn't matter. If in doubt, just swap them around if it doesn't work properly. Just try it out. It's fine. I could turn it on now, but that seems like a lot of effort on my part. And I'd probably melt something because nothing is tidy. <sighs> and the other one goes straight down to the switch, the thermostat switch. And that's it. That's where the lock bars go. Hopefully that will help somebody, if not the person I intended to help in the first place. Um, you never know, it could be handy. Alright, cheers.